Every year, more than 100,000 people come through the Lay showgrounds for the Morobe Agriculture Show. And while the focus has been primarily on agriculture, tradition and culture also play an important part in the whole event. This morning, cultural groups came from all over the country. This is always an opportunity for the older people to teach the young how to make traditional bilas and also what it means for them. Morabe province is a melting pot for people from all over the country. The richness becomes evident during events like this. This show has also brought out the need for a central place to sell artifacts and for Papua New Guinea to develop a system that helps artists and craftsmen to sell their work. Agbron Tui from the Western Islands makes artifacts. It's something he learned from his grandfather. It is an important part of his Western Highlands identity. Paul Yap is also a collector of war relics. It's something very few people do. He's also a craftsman and he says a system needs to be set up to assist people like him. While Morbe may be a melting pot, the province still has a long way to go in terms of the support it provides for arts and culture. There's also serious concerns that languages in urban areas are fast dying out and the traditions associated with those languages are following suit. Scott Wyde, National MTV News, Lay.